Pinpoint is a powerful new tool designed for HL7 interface engineers and analysts. Pinpoint does one thing, and it does it right. It helps you filter message logs when you're troubleshooting HL7 interfaces. So you can spend less time hunting and scrolling, and more time getting the data flowing the way it should. Here's a message log loaded in Pinpoint. If you were troubleshooting manually, this is what you'd see in a basic editor like Notepad. A whole lot of messages to page through. Let's go ahead and do some filtering. For our first example, let's take a look at the test patient with an ID number we're tracking. Here's the ID number. You right-click on the value, select Add Data Filter, and Pinpoint automatically creates the filter that'll give you all occurrences of this ID in this message log. Here are the messages for your test patient in the Messages area. That's a whole lot simpler than scrolling through messages in Notepad. Next, let's look at trigger events. In this case, we want to learn how this interface is handling patient admissions. So we'll go over to the Trigger Events tab, click Select None to clear the checkboxes. And then we select A01 to select for patient admissions. And that automatically filters out the other message types, and you're left with 176 messages to look through, rather than over 5,000. Next, let's look at the Z segments. Here we'd like to understand how this particular provider has set them up in the ADT. And this is useful because Z segments are the customizable segments that change from one provider to the next. So we'll click on the Segments tab, uncheck all segments, scroll down, and just select the Z segment. And there you have it. You didn't have to hunt down customer documentation to see what's going on. You've got the structure right in front of you based on the message log. And that's Pinpoint software in a nutshell. You can filter on trigger events or segments, or you can look for specific data. It's that simple. Download a Pinpoint trial today and see how much easier it is to troubleshoot your interfaces.